counseling micro skills, probing. Hello, it's Lionel. And I still can't find my tail. Lionel, I'd like to start by gathering a bit more background information. Perhaps the community that you live in is a good place for us to begin. Well, you can see I live in the grasslands and I'm part of a pretty large pride. Describe for me what you mean by the word pride. Well, it's not a name we picked, you know. Some explorer dude came here and gave us the name pride, but we've kind of decided we like it. And so now we embrace that term and it's kind of about us as a community and it's about how proud we are of being at the top of the grasslands. Create a bit of a picture for me, Lionel, about what it means to be at the top of the grasslands. Well, you know, those humans might say they're the king of the castle. Well, we're at the top of the grasslands. There's no other animals that really can go after us. We're the ones who rule. But it's really hard without a tail. Hmm. Paint a picture for me, Lionel, of what it's like to go through your day without a tail. Well, I'm kind of disoriented. You know, you can pick everybody out, out across the grasslands by their tail sticking up in the air and nobody can figure out who's coming at them when I come along. I used to be able to be at the front of the pride when we went hunting. But now, without my tail, I'm kind of bringing up the rear. I feel a bit like I'm not as important anymore, all because of losing my tail. Give me a sense, Lionel about how your relationship with other animals on the grasslands has changed since you've lost your tail. I try to keep my head up, but I know they're looking down on me. Every other lion has a tail. I guess it's kind of like I've dropped to the bottom of the grassland, but not quite because I'm still a lion and I still have pride. <laughs>